A civil war has erupted in a quiet, leafy suburb after a neighbor reported a family to the police for cutting back a tree without her permission. Mom Sarah Davis, 40, claims she was forced to take the drastic and expensive action to tackle the large tree after branches encroached on her back garden in Surrey. She claims neighbor Sue Croft had repeatedly ignored requests to cut it back, meaning their garden was being starved of natural light in the summer. But the row exploded this week when a tree surgeon removed a section of their shared fence to chop the branches down. Sharing a picture of the worker on Twitter, Mrs. Croft claimed the surgery amounted to vandalism and trespass. She fumed, Surrey police have determined it's a civil matter so your neighbors can pull down your fence and wander around in your garden without fear of consequences. Welcome to Great Britain. But Ms. Davis blasted her neighbor's complaint and told Mail Online, everyone in the neighborhood lives with her outrage. She is utterly ridiculous. She's completely in the wrong. Mrs. Croft and her husband Michael told Mail Online no permission had been given for the surgery and that they were considering their option. However, Mrs. Davis, who has lived on the Newbold estate for 11 years with her young family, disputes this and says the Crofts were told numerous times. She said, we spoke to her prior to the tree surgery being done, she was fully aware. That tree is hers and she doesn't maintain it. It encroaches on our property and was putting pressure on the hedge and public footpath beneath it, which is now buckling under the strain of the roots and becoming uneven and dangerous. The tree has now been cut back so its limits remain in the Crofts garden. Mrs. Davis claims the tree could still use some topping surgery and that before it was cut she lived in fear of it crashing onto her garden during storm. She continued, we have had storms and it sways violently, it was scary. Last summer we had zero sunlight in our garden because it had overgrown so much. And despite the Crofts vowing to take matters further by consulting their own tree surgeon, Mrs. Davis told Mail Online she was not concerned. She said, what are the police going to do? She's utterly insane. She had her ridiculous willow tree cut back by tree surgeons last week and they had to remove a panel in our fence to get access. She didn't ask us for permission, but it's clearly one rule for us and another for her. Speaking to Mail Online, a spokesman for Slaney's Tree Service said that they had been told full permission had been given and that the fence wasn't damaged.